today, our art lesson is about the artist Giuseppe Archiboldo. Giuseppe Archiboldo lived a long time ago, way back in the 1500s. That's 500 years ago to you and me. He enjoyed painting portraits of people using different foods, flowers, and other objects found in nature. His paintings were intended to be playful and humorous. He liked to make people laugh through his art. This is a copy of one of Archibaldo's portraits. If you look at it from a distance, it looks pretty much like a face. But if you look at it up closer, you can see all the little tiny details, like the nose is a pear, and the apples are the cheeks and cherries for the mouth. Can you find other fruits and vegetables in here? And the flowers? I thought this looked pretty cool. So I decided to make one of my own using crayons and watercolors. Can you tell which foods I put in mine? Yeah, there's a watermelon down here at the bottom. And there's a cantaloupe here and a plum. And I kind of copied the apples for the cheeks and the pears for the nose. I made blueberries for my eyes and the pea pods for the eyebrows. What's that that I made for his hair? It's a combination of a pineapple and carrots on either side. So I used crayons to draw and give definition to all the little fruits. And then for the big areas, I went in with my paints and I painted the background and all the large areas with my watercolors. That's something you could do as well. Or here's another idea. Somebody else made this one. It looks like this artist went into their kitchen and got food out of the refrigerator and the pantry and made a face out of it. You could do that too. If you're eating lunch or you're eating breakfast, maybe you have a big pancake for the face. You could make a face out of your food before you eat it. But let's say you want to keep looking at it. Well, you can't see it after you ate it, right? So you could draw a picture of what you make. All you need is a piece of paper and some crayons and the watercolors like I did. And before you eat your creation that you made, draw a picture of it. So if I wanted to draw a picture of this, I would start off with the watermelon face and put the fried eggs over here for the eyes and make a carrot for the nose. And how about the watermelon mouth or cantaloupe mouth? But he has oranges for the ears. And then after you have everything drawn with your crayon, then you can go in and you could either just color these all in with your crayons or you would rather paint it with your watercolors. You could paint it with watercolors. But just have fun with your food art today. Bye-bye.